now. A drunk driver facing murder charges after allegedly pulling right into the path of a motorcyclist. The jury seeing dramatic video of that fatal crash as Ricky Cantu's trial began. Paul Venema includes that video in his report as he takes us through day one of Cantu's trial. Witnesses told police the night of the wreck that they saw 57-year-old Ricky Cantu driving slowly and erratically as he drove down South Laredo. Slowly, they said, he pulled into the path of 51-year-old Rudy Borrego, who was riding his motorcycle. He puts on his brakes, and eventually he goes to his last resort, which is to lay that motorcycle down on its side. Video of the wreck, captured by security cameras at a nearby business, was played for the jury. The state's first witness in Cantu's trial was traveling behind Cantu. As he's turning, I hear an impact. And how did you know it was an impact? Uh, because I turned to my left after hearing it and I see the motorcycle under the truck. He said that he called 911, then checked on Borrego. He was unconscious. Uh, he wasn't responding. Uh, blood was coming out of the back of his head. Cantu was arrested that night for driving while intoxicated. Because this is Cantu's third arrest for driving drunk, he's facing murder charges, not intoxication manslaughter. That increases the punishment range if he's convicted from 20 years in prison to life in prison. Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.